just like Glenn was just like, let's just look at the top ten places that go be off of YouTube. You just you know step frame through. I think you guys just got a huge pose. And um, if Glenn was here, he would actually be going through each pose and like showing you how awesome and how these poses are totally like anatomically incorrect, <laughs> but somehow Kobe made it all happen because Kobe's a magician and is able to like move his body in crazy ways. And, um, well, my body hurts now. <laughs> 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 but um, yeah, I mean, I think that they just dove in and I think Glenn's process was to study as much as he could, but really get to down to drawing and see, you know, how, how can he make those drawings come to life and really emulate one, Kobe, which is like, one, it's a real person, it's not a character in his head, it's just it's this other level of complexity. It has to be spot on, it has to, um, those drawings have to say Kobe, even from whatever angle. Um, so there was definitely lots of, lots of study and that we were there um, every other way. Yeah, I know, that always has this way of, like, picking out the thing that's right in front of you, that it you feel like you knew, but you didn't know until he said it, and you're like, oh yeah, like the, the jerseys, yeah. how the jerseys move and how they have this, this shape, and they reflect the, the energy. Uh, but without the jersey, you don't really get as much sense of the physicality of the person. So it was like, you really keyed into the jersey, and that movement, and the, uh, the contradicting shapes of them. Right. Uh, like, yeah, without that, it's, uh, it's like Pocahontas without the hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, that, that was a thing about the process that I completely did not understand. And when I said that was when I said, well, I love to be hand drawn to be, you know, so, and you're just like, <sighs> <laughs> I don't understand what that breath meant. <laughs> no, no, not even. I didn't know what that meant. And then when we went through the process, you talk about animated, animated frame by frame mm -hmm. movement of the jersey to carry that energy. The lighting in the room, and making sure the lighting is reflecting and moving the way of the light organically would move. Mm -hmm. And I'm sitting there on the bed, seeing the light hit the posters as you move. Animating that frame by frame, I was like, I don't know why you agreed to do this in the first place. <laughs> this is crazy. Yeah, yeah well, you. I'm like, no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not all there. <laughs> <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> did, did, did you work on paper on this thing? Yeah. Yeah, paper, yeah, paper and it's all scanned in. Wow. Good. Paper, remember yeah. that? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you said, wow. Right now, imagine sitting there at a table <laughs> in Glenn's studio. And Glenn's there with his paper and sketches. And John sits directly across from him <laughs> with his music comes in by pencil that he wrote everything out. I'm sitting there looking like from book to book I'm like <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> it was a crit like dude, it was insane.